So my daughter wanted some lights on her playhouse. I had these LED strips that a lot of people use for neon because you can't really see the each individual uh, LED. They look really nice. They come with some pretty decent clips. Let's see if I can get it to focus there. Not enough, so I used some of these. And then just used a screw. They got double-sided tape, but you know, they're not going to be strong enough. And then I used the zip tie. Still got to trim these off to hold it on. It's pretty flexible. Bends real nice. You can see I got it on this bottom rung here. Then up there also, all the way around. Uh, I didn't want to run an extension cord out here, so that's another reason why I'm using these LEDs, because they're 12 volt. So I'm using a small battery. Eventually, maybe I'll get a small uh, solar panel or something. And then so my daughter won't accidentally leave them on. A household style switch in a fairly water tight container. I still have to staple my wires up, but you can see, just turn it on. And they're on. I'll uh, put the stuff I ordered in the description. And of course, you know, like always, all my videos, it's not a full in-depth uh, how-to just to help you uh, get some uh, ideas so you can build your own stuff. But I'd, I had an electronic version of this, you know, really, really small, but it had some LEDs on it that stayed powered up and I didn't want it to drain the battery. So I figured this would be the uh, simplest, easiest way to not kill the battery. So, uh, enjoy.